My name's Tom Sadler. I work at Humber VHB as a research assistant. There's, there's a lot of things like um, waterborne, airborne sort of diseases which need to be um, sort of got rid of, really. And, um, and there's a lot of trials uh, looking into the improvement of, of the crop, maybe growing them in a, a different, different way or uh, using sort of different feeds and techniques to, to grow them to you know, get a better product out of it. Someone might might be buying this, or you know, maybe Tesco or some I don't know one of these companies, and they'll say, oh, you know, it's um, it's not sort of strong enough. It hasn't got the right flavour. So there's all these sort of things which um, we'll we'll look into, and um, you know, with these experiments and try to improve. I've never had any idea what I want to do in life, and pretty much still don't. It's an ongoing project. <laughs> not knowing what to do, I suppose is. Although it's never really bothered me. I just kind of get on with things day to day and things will turn out how they turn out really. So uh, I'll just kind of try and enjoy it. I finished college and decided not to go to university and um, I've and just started looking for jobs really. And I've had, I've had a couple of jobs prior to this. Um, worked in a supermarket, a hardware shop and, um, and then uh, one day I saw a, an ad in the uh, in the paper for this this job and thought I'd, I'd give it a go really. So um, that's what I did. I think I could be described as quite a lazy student, probably preoccupied with other things, sort of you know having fun really. <laughs> I do enough to get by usually. Um, so yeah, there was never a great enthusiasm to to do sort of school and college work to the greatest of my ability I, I don't suppose. I was probably probably just wanted to be doing other things. Well I didn't go to university I suppose I suppose because because I'd had enough of education pretty much and I don't know it sort of seems expensive and um, you know maybe that was a, a wrong choice maybe it was the right one I, I really don't know. I've never had people on my case getting me to forcing me to do things particularly. They've always encouraged me to to do things how I want to. That goes for my, my parents. They've always encouraged me to, to, to do what I want to do. I've always just, dis I've been quite independent, I suppose. Um, I've just kind of drifted where, you know, just I've ended up where I've, I've ended up. I've got a lot of interests, sort of music and uh, sport. I play cricket, football. I've always been really into to music, listening to blues and folk and rock and roll, that sort of stuff. And I just started playing guitar a few years back, so now I, I just go around here and there and, and play a few songs, you know, I've got my harmonica and guitar and yeah, it's good fun, good fun. They clap occasionally too. I think the main thing is just to in, enjoy um, where you work and and who, well, who you work with, I suppose. You know, I've, I've had rubbish jobs in the past, but I've worked with people I like, and it's, it's fun. They may not be the most well paid, um, so I suppose uh, in the future, money's gonna become more of a, a driving factor in, in, in where I go and what I do. Right now, I'm, I can, I'm 22, I can sort of, <laughs> it doesn't matter to me, really. I don't really plan past next week, to be perfectly honest. Talking of this job, I, I enjoy it now, and I, I, I guess there is, I wouldn't say I'm, I'm in a career right now, I call it a job. It may develop into a career. Who knows, I quite enjoy it, 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 it might happen. But, um, you know, maybe I'll get fed up and go a different direction. That's just how I do things, I think, really.